Today, we're going to talk about a simple, uh, we're basically going to answer a simple question. Is your enterprise perimeter actually equipped to save you from uh, encrypted attacks? And if not, how can A10 Networks with their SSL Insight solution help you to, to counter all those problems? Um, so as you might already know, more than 70% of the internet is already encrypted. And the number can vary somewhere between 70 to 90%, depending on what source you look at. Obviously, this creates a, a big problem for us because um, a lot of your legacy solutions are not really built to uh, look into encrypted traffic. And, and encryption can provide you with privacy, but it doesn't necessarily improve your security. In fact, it might be hurting your security. And what I mean by that is that if you have firewalls that are not really equipped to decrypt traffic or look into it, uh, they're eventually going to create this blind spot where, where all the encrypted attacks can go through. And, and the bad guys have actually figured this out, and they're actually uh, using encryption, uh, the cover of encryption, to slip in more and more Trojans and malware uh, to the point that it's more than, almost half of the malware attacks happening these days are actually using encryption as a mechanism of delivery. Um, another problem with this is, okay, you might be thinking, okay, so what I can do is I have a firewall. What I'm gonna start doing is I'm gonna start decrypting traffic on the firewall. Now you can do that, but the problem with that is that you're gonna see a lot of performance uh, degradation. And this is a simple example. This, uh, this slide is based on an NSS Labs report that recently came out. So one firewall that we looked at was, let's say, giving you 20 gigs of throughput. But after decryption, there was a 90% performance degradation. So what that means is, essentially, to match the originally promised performance, you have to put in 10 boxes that do decryption, and then you get the originally promised performance. Uh, and then this problem is not just uh, limited to one device. In a typical security stack, you might have multiple devices. And uh, for these devices to work, you have to actually decrypt and re-encrypt traffic at each of these hops. That adds a lot of cost in terms of performance, performance degradation. And at the same time, if you're trying to scale up, as I mentioned in the previous slide, you have to spend a lot more money to just scale up to get a better performance. And at the same time, you're really severely uh, deteriorating the user experience for your users. So now the question is, how do you solve this problem? Well, what you need is a dedicated decryption solution that provides you a centralized location of decryption, and then it can feed multiple devices and help you look into the encrypted traffic without uh, facing any performance degradation. So that's where A10 SSL Insight comes in. So the SSL Insight solution it's a dedicated decryption hardware, so it provides you with the best performance possible. Uh, you can scale up to about 25 gigs on a single box, but if you want, you can use two boxes, one for decryption, one for re-encryption, and with that sandwich uh, kind of a deployment, you get twice the performance. Uh, the SSL Insight solution is also extremely flexible and interoperable, so you can have multiple devices deployed in this logical secure decrypt zone that we create. Uh, we can feed the decrypted traffic to inline devices. We can feed it to uh, ICAP-based devices. We can even feed it to devices on a tap. Um, and at the same time, we are a full proxy solution, so uh, we give you that flexibility and control over your traffic so that you can have multiple ciphers on the inside and the outside of the device. And, and if there's any new cipher that is introduced into the network, we easily tackle that problem without bypassing the traffic or, or you know, having a network breakdown. And finally, we're extremely simple and easy to use. So the SSL Insight device comes with this thing called the app-centric template. Um, the app-centric templates actually consist of um, a dashboard, uh, which is specifically made for this product. You can also have custom dashboards. Uh, they provide you with actionable analytics and insights. And at the same time, we provide you these wizards, which I like to call it the five-minute uh, uh, deployment model. So within five minutes, you can go from zero to 100. You can have a brand new out-of-the-box device, and you can configure it within five minutes to be fully functional. Uh, and at the same time, so let's, let's take the same scenario that we discussed earlier. So the 10 boxes that you might need to, per, uh, to match the performance of a single device without decryption, 
if you put an SSL Insight device in there, that can decrypt the traffic for your firewall, and it's essentially giving you the same performance as 10 of the boxes with decryption. So that's a huge uh, uh, saving that you're making on the total cost of ownership because your energy costs are going down, your performance is getting better, and at the end of the day, you're not paying for 10 boxes, you're only putting two boxes in, and you're saving a lot on the rack space as well. And at the same time, looking back at the previous scenario, so all of the devices in your security infrastructure, they're gonna go into the secure decrypt zone that we create. We're gonna intercept all the traffic, decrypt it, feed it into all of these devices. Doesn't matter if it's a DLP or AV system that uses ICAP, if it's a IDS or something else sitting on a tap, or if it's a next generation firewall or IPS in line with the device. Uh, we can also be deployed in layer two, layer three modes, depending on what, what you wanna do. Explicit proxies, we can be an explicit proxy. We also do proxy chaining. At the same time, we're, we're improving performance of your devices and improving the, uh, improving the user experience so that you, your users are getting a better experience out of this whole thing. And there's a huge reduction in latency uh, introduced into the system. And finally, we also have a separate um, centralized management solution uh, it's called the Harmony Controller. So if you deploy that, you can have a centralized management and visibility solution uh, that can actually manage and give you analytics from multiple devices deployed across the globe um, throughout the world, wherever it might be. Um, and then finally, what goes into the decrypt zone? So it's not just some stories that we've cooked up. We actually have a lot of these technical partnerships with some of the big names like Fidelis, Cisco, uh, McAfee, OpsWar, et cetera. And, and we also have documents and things like that uh, for these solutions on our website. So if you wanna learn more about this, go to our website, you'll find a lot of this stuff in there uh, that just verifies uh, that this solution actually works with a bunch of these different vendors and different kinds of devices. Uh, finally, I do wanna talk about the multi-layered security services. So it's not just a decryption engine, it's a lot more than that. So we along with the dedicated decryption, high performance decryption, we also provide you with multiple services like the application layer firewall. So you can uh, detect applications uh, based on app IDs, and then you, we provide you with application visibility, but at the same time, you can control traffic. So if you, let's say, wanna block traffic to a certain kind of application, you can do that with this device. At the same time, you have URL filtering and web filtering, you can use that to improve the productivity of your, of your, uh, of your users, uh, of your employees. At the same time, you can block traffic to certain uh, bad, known, known uh, bad websites and web categories in order to save them from accessing bad files and malware that's already hosted on the internet. We also provide you with ICAP integration so you don't have to buy a separate solution just to deploy an ICAP enabled or ICAP integrated device like a DLP system. Uh, traffic steering, if you wanna do, if you wanna create certain policies and steer traffic according to certain kinds of uh, traffic types, you can do that with the device. And finally, I do wanna talk about the user ID based traffic filtering. So we can integrate with an AD server at the back end. We can also front end the authentication for you, but at the same time, um, based on user IDs, so specific users or user groups, we can actually create specific policies. So let's say your IT team is going through a certain set of uh, security uh, checks while your, uh, um, your development team is not going through certain kinds of checks. So you can have that, that granular control on your traffic if you want to. Um, finally, yeah, we do have some demos set up. We are talking about the multi-layered security services in the back. If you guys wanna come and check that out, have a conversation with us on a deeper level, uh, you're more than welcome to do that. And if you have any more questions, uh, please reach out to me or some of my uh, teammates. Thank you.